hello guys welcome to another video today i want to show you how to make this iso files into a bootable flash drive uh this iso files you, you must have gotten from your manufacturer's recovery to uh bone recovery to like mine is msi i got uh, this is the iso creator uh, there are about six of them it could be seven it could be five depending on how much ISO file you got. Now this ISO file you can copy it to your external and back it up just in case your system has problems so that you can recover your system. Now so many guys are asking the question how to put it on a pen drive. Is uh, I'm going to try something so I want to show you guys uh, how to put it on a pen drive. First we are going to mount this ISO file so you select uh, the six of them, six of the ISO files and click mount. Yeah. So now, uh, you get a Type 2 GB pen drive. Okay, you get a Type 2 GB pen drive. This is my Type 2 GB pen drive. Now you right click, uh, you click on format. Okay. Now you, you get this. For the file system, you select NTFC, not FAT32, NTFC. You select N NTFC, then this, you, leak, you leave it as it is. Then in the label, uh, I prefer to type, uh, you could type whatever you want, but I prefer to type UFD recovery. Then, this is very important, guys. Uh, Quick format, you should disable it. You don't want to do quick format on the pen drive. Uh, just to avoid any errors. So you untick quick format, then you click on start. So my case, I've formatted mine, so I'm not going to do this. Okay. After formatting the pen drive, now what you do is you click on the first ISO mounted disk. Now you copy the whole of this file uh, select all you copy the whole of this file copy you paste it on the pen drive okay uh, now it's copying I'm going to uh, skip pause it okay after copying the first one now you click on the second disk uh, CD2 you click on the second disk you see this file install2.swm you copy also you go to your pen drive directory you scroll then you see this recovery dvd okay you paste install you paste it here paste okay i'll pause the video okay after copying from two you go to three you copy install 3.swm uh, you guys got the idea now you paste in, in your pen drive recovery D DVD you paste it same place same location you just paste now while it's copying let's uh, rename this the first S uh, install.swm I'm going to rename it to a small letter. Uh, install dot swm. It doesn't matter, but uh, I'm just being cautious. I rename it to small letter so it will look, you know, similar to the rest of the files, swm files. So I know it's not it's nothing, but I just like it that way avoiding mistake okay so the file is still copying um, I'm going to pause the video okay 3 has copied now we'll go copy 4 install 4.swm copy to same location paste now pause it okay now we've copied for let's go and copy the fifth one okay install 5.swm copy 
pastes. Okay, ahead and pause. Okay, we've copied the fifth one. Let's go ahead and copy the last one. Yeah, we're almost done copying, copying, copying. Okay, paste. Then I pause here. Okay, now we've copied the last one. Okay, let's create a, a text. Call it new text document. Let's call it UFDR. Okay. Now in this text, we write something UFDR. Uh, we save, save, then we close. Okay, now we need to check for a file. We need to make sure the file is there. You scroll down, you go to boot. I'm sorry, sources. Yeah. Okay, we have the file boot.wim. Now, after that, don't forget to rename the pen drive to this. Uh, you can assign any drive later, it doesn't matter. You have the recovery, don't forget to rename it to this. Uh, now, the, there are two things. We could either try to see if it will work directly, or we could run a command prompt to set this uh, drive, uh, this drive disk to be able to enter boot manager. So let's try and see if it will work directly without using the CMD. What you do is you click on your power button. Okay, you hold your shift. You hold your right, sh your left shift or your right shift and click on restart. Okay. Yep. Now we've come into the troubleshooting options. You see, you see where they say use a USB, use a device, use a USB drive or whatever. You click on that. Now this is our our pen drive is showing. So for my is showing. For yours, if it's not showing, I will show you the code in CMD in which you will type so that it will show. Uh, if it's not showing, but usually it should show. Okay. Now let's try it. I click on it. Voila, <laughs> it works. So, yeah, that is it, guys. It is showing this the recovery area. Now, uh, I would prefer for you to try this first before going for this because this will clear the whole partition. Try this first. If this works, then later you do it again. You come back and you do this to create the recovery partition and all the factory partitions. So you try this first. So that is it. Uh, that is how to uh, import your ISO files into pen drive and make them recoverable. So I'll just go ahead and show you the code. I'll go back to my window.